What's up guys, it's your boy Dean Charlie, and as you can see from the title down below, it's a reaction to Demi Lovato's new song, well, album, but we're only listening to one song. And I chose the song Lonely, so we're going to listen to that because that's featuring Lil Wayne. And apparently this album was based, like, in Christina Aguilera inspired. That's what she said. So, I'm here. I'm waiting for some, those little girl things that she does. I can't do it. Probably can if I try, but I can't do it. So, therefore, <laughs> let's get into this video. Oh, uh, and the song may ch change a very little bit, but, yeah, that's for copyright reasons, you know. Oh, shit! <laughs> My keyboard! Uh. Okay. Let's pretend that didn't happen. I really like the little tattoos she got, though. I love them. She's starting off saying that this guy looks just like them, so... I guess this song is about a song about a guy that acts just like an ex. So I guess she's a little, or it could be a guy or it could be a girl. Cause lately, hold on Demi. Lately, um, I think about two like weeks ago, she was caught in Disney World. Or, no, Disney World. Uh, that's for the East Coast side. She was caught in Disneyland <laughs> um, over there in California. And she was all canoodling up with this girl. And the girl was had her hand all over her ass. So, but she doesn't want to stick to any labels. So, she was like, if you want to find out, watch my YouTube um, documentary that's coming out October 27th, I think. If I'm not correct, please comment down below. I don't, I know it's in October. I know that for sure. And I love these glasses. Oh my god. <laughs> um, so yeah. I, I could just turn it up, right? <clears throat> this is like a song you could just like chillax. Makes you think about shit. Ooh, she said now she's fucking lonely. This is gross, watch. Oh, <laughs> I can't do it, but she's on it. So I guess that's like the, because Kristen Aguilera, if you know her music wise, not know her personally, but if you know her personally, that's good. But her music wise, she always got these little growls. This It's like a relaxing song. Let me fucking... No more Disney girl. I mean, actually, I think the Disney girl, Disney Demi left when she came up with the song "Cool for the Summer." Uh, don't tell your mother we're cool for. No, it's shit. I just go. I got a cherry and a song. I forgot that line, but she talked about popping some girl's cherry. So <laughs> that's all I know. Um. My face though. Popping somebody's share, that's all I know, so. Let's get back into this, so. Bob my hair with his butt, it's like making me happy. Without ya. The only reason I know because it's just playing over. I'm living for this album cover, though. She's like... <laughs> JK, she's not doing all that. But it looks like... I know I'm supposed to be reviewing the song, but you know, I'm also reviewing the album cover. I can't help it. Oh, shit. <laughs> it 
<laughs> it's very soothing. Y'all gotta listen to it. Like, if y'all can't hear it clearly, y'all need to go download the song, iTunes, iClouds, matter of fact, scratch that, YouTube it. <clears throat> and then come back to this reaction. And don't forget to give this reaction a thumbs up. Like, it's not the song you chat to. So, I like the song, I, and I feel like Lil Wayne gonna be doing auto tune the whole damn time, and I don't have time for it. I don't, honestly, I don't have time for it. Honestly, truly, I don't. But it's a good song. It's very calming and relaxing, soothing. Um, I'm living for this album cover, the black and white. You know, when she was younger, she had a very defined butt chin. Like, I don't know if I was the only one that noticed it, but every time she was like, huh, that butt chin, she has a very defined butt chin. It's not a bad thing. It's cute. It's cute. It suits her. Some people look like a little chin, but it suits her. And her little freckles that she got going on here, I like how her freckles are just like, well, that's like a genetic thing. Her freckles are like right here and right here. Some people with freckles like, Lindsay Lohan, which, by the way, she looked like she got her shit together. She was on the cover of some French magazine. She had freckles all over. But it looked like she just got defined in, like, one area and stuff like that. But, y'all, go support my girl, Zemi Lovato, and get this album, like, after I get off of him, but I go listen to the rest of the motherfucking album because, like, ah, and I can't wait <laughs> Figure out the um the uh, uh um the uh music videos. <laughs> I had a brain fart, but anyways, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Deuces.